Hello YouTube, it is Malachi21 and I have not done a video in quite some time. Um, I want to take the time for this video to go over the recent changes they did to the Zealot Overdrive Max on the uh, Banu Sovereignty. Um, let's go to the virtual reality training real quick. Now, oh man, they really shit on us, um, really. Why did I switch my loadout? Okay. But the biggest issue is with this new Zoe here, um, there are significant changes that were in place for this. The Zoe now has a 15 second timer. Um, sucks, okay? They're. Uh, you, once you activate it, it does not get disabled. You can't disable it. You cannot activate it on demand. It just appears and, you know, it appears and then disappears in a certain amount of time. And there's a cooldown timer for it. Um, also, I must add, the close quarters damage uh, on the Zoe was all that was improved. Now, they used to have damage across the board. Damage bonus. Hi! Hey. They used to have a damage bonus across the board, um, but now it's only for close quarters combat. Now that, if you are a Zoe player, if you're a VS player, you'll understand that it gives you an advantage, but it keeps the NC Max in its prime. The NC Max is still going to be the most powerful close quarters Max, so you're not going to do much good going against it with the Zoe even now. Um, but you'll see as if you play it it's a little bit different than the original uh, another thing is movement speed was reduced but i believe forward speed used to be a 100 percent increase and now it's 50 percent and the i believe the lateral directions left right uh you know strafing is only a 40 percent increase in speed so the speed isn't where you can outrun infantry anymore so let's activate this thing okay i'm activated and as you can see you are I'm unable to turn it off. I'm hitting the buttons. I cannot turn it off. Um, and you're pretty much, once you activate it, you are obligated to use it. Otherwise, as you can see, it just goes off. Um, you really don't have any chance to really um, abuse it as it was before. Um, like, I agree with the fact that it was nerfed. I really do. I, I agree that it was nerfed, but I don't really believe that it deserved the extent that it did. The problem being, uh, we have a unit that was always, you know, um, full situation. Any situation it can it can handle. Now it's kind of limited into in that uh, it's only useful for close quarters combat now. Um, it's more situational now, so you can activate it in the middle of a heated battle and take out some troops, so I'm a little bit okay with that. Um, but I can understand where SOE was going with that. They were probably upset that this was a, a, a flat upgrade for the standard Z VS Max, so it definitely got upgraded significantly. Um, now... I don't really believe that it should have been nerfed to where it was. Uh, it should have probably, I really think that it should be allowed to be used all the time, but there should be some serious uh, damage, debuffs rather. Um, personally, I'm a guy that agrees with the movement speed that it offered more than I, I care much about the damage. I'm really about the movement speed. It makes this max very scary. Um, and if you, in my opinion, if you're going to keep the movement speed or nerf the movement speed massively then give us some damage bonus not in necessarily close quarters combat but i understand that they don't want us to snipe everybody um there were a lot of complaints you know about the original zoe how overpowered it was and now there's nothing really to complain about i, th I think it, it it's pretty well balanced um you tr maxes will pretty much give you a run for your money now they aren't completely overbearing anymore you 
Um, or you aren't completely overbearing to them anymore, rather. So it'll equalize the playing field a lot. I've died by a lot more TR maxes than I used to. Um, they used to be pretty goddamn easy to kill. Um, and NC maxes were my only problem. So, um, but now, you know, it is what it is. I'll miss it, but what are you going to do, right? I'm sure they'll have some more changes to it. And hopefully they um, keep keep this uh, content going. Uh, I'd really appreciate that they pay attention to everything the users say. Um, that they value our opinion on users. Um, or by users, rather. So it just shows that this game has their act together. Anyway, this is Malachi21. I will be doing more videos uh, on a multitude of things uh, in the upcoming weeks since my Christmas break has started. So, um, yeah. Uh, I'll see you in the next video, guys. Thank you.